All right, now, y'all, I'm going to show you all how I do my cream corn, okay? So I had to wash off the tops, of course, and you know I had to open them. And when I open them, I always try to see if there's anything within that's on top that I might not like. That way, I'll dispose of the can. So I'm just going to open this other can. I'm having a little hard time, but I'm going to open this other can just to go on ahead and see if there's anything that I'm not happy with <laughs> so I can dispose of it. Okay, there we go. All right. Had to put that little um, can opener away, get it on out my sight. Okay, that one looked good. That one looked good as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go on ahead and um, use some of the onion and garlic that I had sautéed for a different video. I had made salmon croquettes, so I'm going to use some of that as well. But right now with the same pot that I did the onions and garlic, I'm going to put my butter in there. You know, because ain't up a flavor up in there. So I'm just going to let it just cook all together. And I did add a teaspoon of white sugar granulated sugar in here i don't know why it didn't show up but anyway i did put that in i don't like mine too sweet so that little bit is just enough for me and so i'm just stirring it to make for sure everything is incorporated and i'm going to go on ahead and put the top on and let it just do its thing by itself and here we go can y'all see the little creaminess on top Yes, that's that butter and that sugar. And here we go. That's what I did with the cream corn. I paired it with the salmon croquettes.